Welcome back to a FS17 mod review here on the Squirrel Farms map. Today we'll be taking a look at a very big mod pack released by Wood Meadow Farming. The download link will be down below in the description. Big shout out goes out to him for releasing all of these mods. Up first we'll be taking a look at a Ford F550 regular cab chip truck. This is color changeable here with a few different options. The front end of this looks amazing here. Color changeable wheels which is also nice. Guys can see steps there and it is a power choke underneath the hood which is pretty cool now this is where you attach a wood chipper and all of the wood chipping goes into the back of it which is nice it does have a working back gate here that opens up all the lights to work bumpable hitch and it also does have toolboxes here which are awesome once we hop here on the inside this has a top speed of 76 miles per hour all of the lights do work here on it you guys can see all of those there in the back and this thing looks awesome it does have a plow mount as well up front and it looks like it does have some strobes here which is nice strobes up top which is very helpful and a few strobes here in the back now when you do press control I to unload all of the wood chips the back door opens up wide and then you guys can see there it goes now the toolboxes are separate from the dump bed which is a very nice feature there this thing looks awesome and I can't wait to use this here in many different videos now on the first person view it does have an interior rear view very detailed you guys can see pretty realistic dash and it does have a cat there. We'll take this here for a quick spin. And I'm very excited for all of these pretty cool mods. I can't wait to use them here in videos. And Wood Metal Farming has been releasing some epic mods. So big shout out goes out to him. Go check out his website and his Facebook page down below in the description of today's video. The handling of this truck is on point. And I do really do like having it color changeable to any different company spec. Which is awesome. So next up we'll be taking a look at another uh, truck related to tree services. This will be an F750 bucket truck. And then you guys can see it does have the chip in there on the back. Now this does have stable barrelizers. It is color changeable. And you guys can see this thing looks awesome. It does have the bucket up top there. The protection over the cab. And this is a brand new 2017 F750. It's a 6.7 liter power stroke. It has a stabilizer. There's toolboxes. And a very nice dump bed. And take a look at those wheels. Those wheels look awesome. And I am running the shaders mod. I will have to say here for today's mod review let me know if you guys would like me to use it more or i can easily remove it and we do have a bumper pull hitch here which is nice once we hop here on the inside of the f750s top speed of 33 miles per hour which is nice all of the lights do work here on this which is awesome guys and see everything does work it has working strobe lights two up front there in the front end and then it does have those two there in the back which is pretty cool and i mean this thing looks awesome so when you do press x the stabilizers will come down that's very realistic to have those and then you guys can see here is a bucket moving just take a look at that i mean this is awesome we'll first rotate it to the side and then we'll kind of see how high this goes up now this thing really does look pretty cool and we'll just take a quick look so it looks like it goes all the way up like this and then this will bring it back down so this will go up we'll move the camera view so i mean it can go very high up if you do want it and the bucket looks like does stay level which is also a very big bonus i mean that's pretty helpful and you guys can see you could actually pretty much lower it all the way to the ground there pretty much and then when you get out you get out actually here at the bucket so you could turn the chainsaw on do it and then you could hop back in the truck to move it around so that's a pretty epic thing and then the last thing we'll take a look at here is the working chip bed you guys can see it fully functions which is also very cool and this is color changeable here we'll turn this off and up next we'll be taking a look at a few different bucket trucks now these are very cool bucket trucks the first one up here is a line or very similar trucks just a different style of a bucket up above now this is color changeable here it looks like it's mainly for power got stabilizers here awesome fuel tanks the wheels here are color changeable very long platform probably for putting cones anything like that it does have our bumble pull hitch and here is the bucket that looks awesome really do like these a lot great textures and great work by wood metal farming now all of these lights do work here which is nice it does have strobe lights there take lock those on the mirrors in the back and that just looks awesome now like i have touched upon this is color changeable we'll pull this forward here and we'll just take a quick look at it top speed of 33 miles per hour working steering wheel here in very detailed first person 
awesome view, which is nice. I really do like it a lot. Wow, that looks awesome. Next up, you do have a camera view up top here, which is perfect. We'll just uh, put down those stabilizers, and let's take a look here at this bucket. Now, this is a pretty cool design. Take a look at that. It actually lifts all the way up, and it lifts the camera up as well. So, wow, you could go pretty high up to work on any telephone poles, power lines that you do need. That is awesome. really do like this a lot, and you could pretty much lower it just to about there. So that looks awesome. When you do get out, it looks like you do get out right up there, which is awesome. But overall, one very cool bucket truck. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a very similar Freightliner bucket truck. Now this one here is a different version of it, which is pretty cool. First, uh, take this here for a spin. Both have the same handling. And I mean, all these are awesome ones. And I do use a lot of wood metal farming mods, and I do appreciate him for releasing all of them. It, this thing really does drive nice top speed at 33 miles per hour. Everything does work very well on this. So up next, uh, we'll put the stabilizers down, and we'll just take a quick look here at this one. Now this is a very interesting one. It's a much smaller design, and you guys can see take off that, so this actually slides out. This is perfect. I really do like having that, and it does go pretty far. So you guys can see it's a little bit of a different design, bucket truck-wise, and I just really do like having those different designs. And it looks like the... Uh, bucket there does not stay level unless you can fix it. We'll take a quick look. It looks like uh, you can't really adjust that, but wow, one very, very cool truck. Up next, we'll be coming over here and taking a look now at emergency vehicles. Up first, we'll be taking a look at an old Mac engine. Take a look at this, guys. Pretty cool. It looks to be engine one here, Mac. And it is also color changeable to have any different color fire departments, which is awesome. Very nice wheels. Just take a look at the quality here of these wheels. The bake on this is awesome as well. You guys can see great looking uh, front end here. This thing looks awesome. I really do like having a variety of older and newer fire trucks here in the back. You guys can see lots Lots and lots of hoses, and this is one awesome one. Once we hop here on the inside top speed at 76 miles per hour, all of the lights do work here on it. We'll just pull forward just enough, and you guys can see everything does work like that. Wow, that looks awesome. Next up, we'll take a look here at the strobe lights, which is, uh, you guys can see a few there. And then when you do press home, the bigger lights turn on there, which is nice. And then next up, we'll take a look at the sirens. And the horn. I really do like all of those. That's awesome. We'll take this here for a quick spin. And I will definitely be adding this here to the Fire Rescue Series. Now, it does not have an interior rear view, but you guys can see it does have a few back seats there, which is nice to those firefighters. And wow, that looks awesome. They're reflecting off of the building. Like... Like I have touched upon, I do have a shaders mod here installed in today's mod review. Let me know if you guys would like me to keep it or remove it. I think it does add a bit of more textures here to my farming cylinder. It definitely looks awesome. So next up, we'll turn these off, and uh, we'll be taking a look at an F550 rescue truck. And I mean, these are some pretty epic trucks. Really do like lots. We'll uh, turn that off. And up next, you guys can see regular cab F550 rescue truck, color changeable wheels. You guys can see bumper pull hitch, and wow, this looks awesome. I really do like the back design. It, very nice chrome take. Look, they're very high quality textures on all of the vehicles we've looked at today. And once again, it, the entire thing is color changeable and it, it does have a plow mount. That's an awesome feature. Next up, we'll take a look here at all of the strobe lights. That looks awesome. Those look pretty cool. You guys can see everything like that works. We'll take a look at all of the regular lights and looks like those two spotlights up front. And let's kind of take a look at that. So it looks like we can do that. Next up, we'll uh, hear the sirens. It does have some very nice sirens. We'll take this here for a quick spin, and the interior is very nice. You guys can see great steering wheel and very detailed dash, and you guys can see there are seats here, which is pretty cool. We'll actually be taking this here for a quick spin. So far, this rescue truck is very nice. I do like the compact size of it, and it's very low profile. What I mean by that is good clearance-wise up top if you do want to bring in some pretty tight areas. But wow, this thing looks awesome. You guys can see a few orange lights there flashing. And overall, I just really do enjoy all of the mods we are taking a look at today. Up next, we'll be taking a look at a F550 ambulance here. Very nice. It is color changeable once again. It, and it has a very interesting bumper, a chrome-wise, but this thing looks awesome. Now, no interior here, but that is okay. I mean, this thing really does look pretty cool. The back end does also look nice, and it's the same handling, same everything as the other one. 
We'll turn those off. We'll turn on these strobe lights. Very, very cool strobe lights. Everything like that. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's mod review. Big shout out once again. It goes out to Wood Metal Farming for releasing all of these. Thanks for watching. Go check out the download link down below to this pack. Have a great day and subscribe for more. Yeah.